Hey, I'm Brent, you're watching Seam Culture. Welcome and thank you so much to our longtime viewers. We love our new viewers too, and we wanna make you a longtime viewer. So subscribe below and we'll send you new content each and every week. Well, today I wanna to tell you about this called the Resurgum. Now this is a submarine and it was built in the late 1800s by George Garrett, who actually was a preacher. Kind of looks like a college baseball player these days. But he was a preacher and he built this submarine. And the intent of it was to break the, there was a chain netting that would hang below ships and it was intended to uh, deflect torpedoes. Well, the resurgum was made to actually pierce that thing. And then as I read, reverse, shoot a torpedo through the now broken chain and blow the ship up. That was the intent. Now, the first one was built with a uh, kind of a hand operated crank to propel the submarine back and forth. The second one was built with a steam engine. In fact, a closed cycle steam engine. Now, pretty tight fit as you can see from these pictures, but it employed something called a Rankin cycle. Now, this is how a Rankin cycle works. It's self-enclosed and you have a pump that pumps water to the boiler where the heat transfer occur occurs. It's heated, creates steam. That high pressure steam is sent to a turbine where it acts upon the turbine blades turns the turbine blades, which turns a crank, which turns the propeller. Now, after the steam comes through the turbine, it's taken to a condenser where it's cooled and it returns to its liquid state, which is then sent to a pump and it's sent through the process over and over and over again. That is the Rankin cycle. Now, interestingly, resurgum in Latin means I shall rise again. If you can see from these pictures, clearly somebody was wrong. It's still sitting at the bottom of an ocean, took on water and sank, never to be rising again. I think that's Latin. Anyway, probably not. So join us next Friday because I will have new content for you. If you haven't seen all of our content, Google us because we have great stuff each and every week. Go check out a Boiling Point. You can learn something about steam, about boilers, about combustion, about anything you want to learn. Except for politics, we don't do that, but we do do steam. So, see you next Friday. Thanks for joining us.